In this video, we'll use SPSS to run a standard multiple regression. Specifically, we'll use customers' disposable income and estimates of what others would pay to predict the amount that they chose to pay for a record which they were able to set their own price for. Now, price paid is the criterion or dependent variable, and weekly disposable income and price others would pay are the predictor or independent variables. And these are all ratio variables, and we're seeking to predict or account for variance in one, price paid, with knowledge of the others, disposable income and price others would pay. Now, as we have no rationale for entering the predictors into the regression model in blocks, we'll enter them simultaneously. And consequently, we'll be running standard multiple regression. Now, if we move over to the data view and scroll down the screen, you can see that in total, there is data here from 65 cases. So in the Analyze menu, select Regression and then Linear. Move the criterion variable, which is price paid, into the dependent field and move the predictors, which are weekly disposable income and price others would pay, into the independence list. In the Statistics dialog, select confidence intervals, descriptives, part and partial correlations, and collinearity diagnostics. And then click continue. In plots, select standardized residuals and move it into the Y field. And then select standardized predicted values and move it into the X field. And then also select histogram and normal probability plot. And then click continue. In the save dialog, select Mahalanobis and Cooks under distances. And then under residuals, select standardized. And click continue. And finally click OK and your output will appear in the SPSS viewer. 